Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today you may be wondering what this video is about and why it's a bit different to usual. Well, if you have been watching my vlogs then you will know that most recently, the summer just gone, I was very lucky enough to go to America and it was absolutely amazing. I got to go to the Niagara Falls and then I went to PA to visit some of my family and friends there which was absolutely amazing. Probably the best summer ever. Just had an incredible time. So I thought with that I bought a lot of candy and got gifted a lot of candy and also very nice snacks that I thought I would talk about. So that's the reason why I'm wearing an Uts t-shirt which I bought from the factory. Basically Uts is essentially the American version of Walkers. It's a very famous crisps brand and everybody over there loves it. As you can see the little lady there is their little mascot. It's on every single logo and this is like Summer Bash on the back. Um, I bought this from the shop as the factory is actually only about half an hour from my relatives which is really cool. I visited the Uts factory and it was really interesting to see how crisps are made. It was very very greasy, very very hot but it's amazing how many they make. They have so many different types. And I've actually got two types, which I'm gonna show you guys, um, because I thought it would be really cool. And I'm also gonna taste test them right here on my channel. So let's start with the Arts products. So first of all, we've got the Kettle Classic Sweet Potato. Now, kettle corn is something that we don't get in the UK because we already have kind of sweet popcorn, but kettle corn is a mix of salted and sweet kind of popcorn, so it's a mix of both. But this isn't that, That this is very much um, kettle sweet potato, so it's basically sweet potato crisps, kind of like the vegetable crisps that we get at places like the Co-op and things like that in the UK. So let's open this and have a little taste, shall we? Uts, 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 branding. <laughs> As you can see, the little lady is there again. Um, but here they are. So these do look like the vegetable crisps that we get in the UK. So let's give this a go. Mmm. Very good. I love it when you chew on it. It kind of melts. Like, and then make, then it actually tastes like sweet potato. I'm going to have a second it's so good. Mmm. Love that. I'm going to seal that nicely so it stays nice and fresh. Okay. So I got that one from the Arts Factory store, which is really cool. The next one, which is also from the Arts Factory store, is the Ripple Barbecue Flavoured Potato Chips. That was a terrible max American accent, so apologies if my American relatives are watching. But it is the hungry size, and it is gluten-free, which is amazing. Um, that looks fairly standard, actually. Um, just basically like McCoy's, really. But a lot sweeter. Their barbecue crisps are a lot sweeter than the UK ones, um, which I really like about them, so that's why I bought them. So I've actually already got an open packet, so I thought I could open these and then give them a little taste, even though I have tried these, I have to admit, already. So, have I got a decent one? I have, yeah. So they are basically crinkled, but I'm to the end of this packet because they're so good. Love Uts, not sponsored by the way. Mmm, very good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Yeah, definitely much sweeter than the UK. Mmm, love that. Okay, so now we've done the savoury, I wanted to move over to the sweet. Now, I've got some very cool stuff, and some of it's limited edition, some of it comes out every year, which I love, and it's also really exciting. So, the first thing that I'm going to show you is, as it's fast approaching, that is Autumn. Now, this is called Autumn Mix, and it's by, I think it's Brashes? or branches, I don't know, but it's Mellow Cream Autumn Mix, and it is, of course, the very famous candy corn of America, as you can see there. Now, candy corn, the best way I can describe it is like, you know the soft banana sweets that we get from like Morrison's and places like that in the UK? This is kind of what they taste like, but they're a lot sweeter, and it's made with real honey, so they're honey flavored, which is really nice. So I thought I'd open these, and also give them a try. They've got like little pumpkins. You often see them in like movies like Halloween Town. Kind of. Look, how adorable is that? It's a little, little pumpkin, a little American pumpkin. I love that. So let's have a taste. Mmm. Sometimes they remind me of toffees. They chew like toffee, like, crossed with fudge. More so fudge. But it's a very unique flavour. And I like that about them. And this one. 
it's kind of traditional candy corn, but usually you get them yellow, orange, yellow, orange and white, and black, um, but yeah, little cones there. Mm. Usually they're kind of different flavours, there you go. And there's another type there, a yellow, orange and white. Mm. Delicious. So that's those, made with real honey. Moving on swiftly, I'm going to move on to Peeps. Now, Peeps aren't an autumn thing. These are actually available in the spring, but sometimes you can find them all year round. But generally speaking, they are Easter classics and they are marshmallows covered in sugar. You can probably see them there and you can hear them. Um, but they also do Christmas ones now and I believe they do Halloween ones. So actually, they are actually available all year round now. But that's quite cool. But it says, open a package of peeps and open a world of possibilities. From creative crafting, imaginative artwork, to delicious recipe and more. Let the fun begin. Express your peepsonality. Yes, peeps. So I'm, I'm, I'm not going to open those actually. I have tried these before. But they're very delicious, but I have to keep them packaged so that they stay fresh. Um, but they're really soft and cute, and as you can see, they literally look like little chicks, which is cute, so adorable, and very Easter, as you can imagine. Yay! Okie dokie, so, the next one on my list is the very famous Jolly Ranchers. Now, traditionally, these are hard-boiled sweets. They're manufactured by Hershey, the chocolate company, and they're very, very good, but these ones are different. These ones are strips. They look like Malwams, and I don't know if they taste like them, but I'm going to try one right now. Here we go. Da -da -da. Okay, I'm going to try an apple one. So it's hard candy. So they're still... Oh, these are a lot more rock hard than um, Malwams, so I'm probably going to take that back. I think these are more... What, what sweets do we get that are kind of a bit harder? The cherry ones. Um, you know the long cherry kind of sweets that we get that look like lollipops but aren't? Those. I think that's what they are. Anyway, if you know, let me know in a comment below. I can't remember what they're called. All these are quite difficult to get into. And eventually, I'm in. <laughs> I'm glad I paused that. Okay, so they're not like Malams at all. Oh, and they look like the hard-boiled sweets, but they're stick versions, so they're long sticks. Mmm. I love the apple, watermelon, and blue raspberry ones. Those are my favourites. Mm -mm -mm. So it's like a lollipop, really, but in the form of a stick rather than just the Jolly Rancher boiled sweet. Mm. This one's going to take a while, so I'm going to come back to it. That's delicious. Mm -mm -mm. I love American candy. Yay! So the next one is actually available in Europe and some places in the UK, but it is an Oreo Big Crunch Bar by... Milka! I don't think you say that. Milka. Anyway, Milka is traditionally a European, actually, chocolate that was started up, but they now sell it in America. And there's lots of chocolate and lots of good Oreo in there. And, of course, Oreo started in America, so I'm very excited to eat this at some point as a treat. But as you can see, very long, very big, very delicious, I'm sure. Yay! Okay, so moving on. Moving on to the next food product. This one I'm really excited by, as I probably might even save it for bonfire night, that's a clue. They are exclusive limited edition firework Oreos with popping candy. How cool! Popping candy in the middle of an Oreo, who would have thought it? But they look delicious. I think I'm going to keep it sealed. No, I'm not. I'm going to try it because why not? I can reseal it. That's the genius of these Oreo packets. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Give this a go. Here we go. Okay, so if I open it up like I would normally, you can see kind of the colourful rainbow pieces in it. Let's give this a go. I have no idea what it's going to taste like. But I will warn now, this will probably make my... I'm just going to take the, the bit of milk bit. Mmm. Weird sensation to have them popping. Strange. Anyway, Oreos make my teeth go black, so for this video I probably won't do that because then I'll have, like, black teeth. Um, I probably should have saved them for last, but anyway, mmm, delicious all the same. Tastes good. Mmm. Here we go. Pop, 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 pop. I do love popping candy. Have you ever had it? It literally feels so good. So one final thing, which is really great for taking to anywhere really, it's a bit like a mint or um, a chewing gum, but 
It's not chewable, it's edible, it's sour, it's sugary, it's really, really nice, I don't know if you can guess, but it's called Icebreakers. Now, Icebreakers come in all kinds of different flavours, but my favourite pack is the original, which is watermelon, green apple and tangerine, and you can get a mix of one type of flavour or you can get mixed, um, so it's all got the different types and you can open them at different points. Um, but they are really small sweets, so I'm going to open them, here we go. So this is the many entrance. The great thing about these is they last a long time, but they make your kind of breath smell good and also they taste amazing. So let's go for many. Here we go. I'm going to open that very carefully. So when you open the many part, you have that. But if you open the one part, you get at random. So my favourite is the apple and watermelon. Um, so let's give this a go. The watermelon is red and green spots. The tangerine is orange and the green apple is just green. So let's do the watermelon. So they're quite, these ones are quite big, a lot bigger than the usual ones that I get. You can get them in smaller ones too. I think these are slightly bigger. Anyway, here we go. It says, with flavour crystals, natural and artificial flavours. Here we go. Um, yum. Oh, so juicy and sour. I love it. Mm, mm, mm. So yeah, that is, oh, there's a star kicking in. Mm, mm, mm. I love it though. Tastes so good. So that is my video all about sweet and savoury snacks of America. Yay, American snacks. I just love them and decided to do a video about them because I thought it was lots of fun. So thank you so much for watching. If you did like this video, give a big thumbs up click subscribe and if you've tried any of these sweets then let me know in a comment below so we can talk more about them. Whoop whoop. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.